kidding. Um, I will get to that uh, shiny thing here in a Um, but I'm gonna show what I'm gonna keep in my tactical vest until I get a different one. Um, just in case if I were to need it. Um, it does have little foam plates. It's uh, airsoft or paintball. Take your pick. Um, but my main video uh, purpose for this video is for my duty belt. It came in the other day, as I said. Um, I already have my radio pouch on it, or my phone case, however you want, whatever you want to call it. But I have my radio in it. I'm going to take it and put it back on charge. But um, here I have my multi tool again but this is what i was talking about. these things here they're not real belt keepers they're for looks you know it's kind of like a an antique car almost you know more of like them uh it's more for looks not for play but uh, i'll probably just i'll probably keep them on there for now just for looks and then later on get rid of them and um when I get some actual belt keepers. Otherwise, it doesn't really matter right now. I don't care. I'll just readjust it if I have to. It's not like I'm running or anything. <laughs> but, I'm going to get over into my vest real fast. Um, I'm going to show what I have in each pocket. Um, in this little pocket here, um, I have my knife. Unless I'm just walking around, you know, say I'm going to Walmart or whatever, gas station or whatever. I'll just put it in my pocket. But if I have my vest on, I'll have it in that pocket there. Then close that up. Um, I don't have any patches for this yet. Well, actually, I do have one. I need to find it. I'm going to put it on right here on the front because it's just too small to put on the back. But I keep a little pin here, you know, in case I need to write, you know, whatever. But there's two pockets here. And the bigger one, I keep a pair of uh, half gloves, half finger gloves. Yes, they are workout gloves, but I don't care. Um, it's just for like if I'm going to be riding my bike or whatever, then I know right where they're at, they're in my vest. You know, I shouldn't lose my vest, so if I lose my vest, there's an issue. <laughs> but um, they'll always be in my vest, so they'll be there um, if I need them. Or if I'm going to well, work out or whatever. But in the smaller pocket, I have my gum. Kind of a mint flavor, but and I keep my phone in that uh, pocket as well. Um, and there's this big pocket here. And there's a big pocket here. In this, I'm going to start keeping some medical supplies, just some basic band-aids and bandage and stuff. Uh, just some scissors to cut uh, the bandage wrap. Um, some alcohol prep pads. Got a bunch of those. You know. Got a, this is all I have right at the moment. I'm, I'm wanting to go to like CVS or uh, like kind of like a drugstore and get a get some more get some new medical supplies I mean they're not too old but they're starting to get old so I'm gonna go ahead and switch them out eventually but until I get the chance to I'm gonna go and keep them in there but one like a uh, knee bandage I guess you could call it and in here I have some regular band-aids some bigger ones I think there's some butterfly bandages in there as well um, yeah there's some bigger ones I don't know if you can see it or not there's some bigger ones in there um, there's like this tape in here. I don't know how well this tape will work, but we'll figure it out whenever I need it. Hmm, bag came open. Well, I'll fix it here in a minute. Then as you can see, I have this 4x4 four four piece of uh, gauze pad right here. And then I have a little bit of... A second. Hmm. Uh, just some uh, bandage wrap. You know, just basic medical medical stuff. You know, say someone falls off their bike or and they get a good big cut in their leg. You know, wrap it up until fire department or uh, paramedics get there. Whoever gets there first, depending on if the fire department has to go or not. 
got me some paper. It was not the best. I don't care. E quick and easy to take notes on. Um, I don't really need to upgrade my paper. I got a bunch of this stuff that I can use. So I'll just use that. But um, I'm going to flip it over here to the back. I know you're wondering, wasn't there something else? I think there's something else. Another pouch. But um, I did figure out how to feed the cabling in there. So, uh, so, yep. And then on the back, these two mag pouches are empty. This one here has that daisy chain in it. You know, I doubt if I'll ever need it. But if I were to need it, you know, to tie something to secure it. Or, you know, say someone falls and breaks their leg. Say I'm hiking with someone and I just so happen to have my vest for some stupid reason. Boom. Okay, I have it. I can use that for a splint. That's probably like 20-some feet of rope. Like I've done in my previous videos. But. And then the shiny on the front. Hang on a second. Get all this stuff out of the way. Oh, and I have some beef jerky here. Some Jack Leach. Jack Link's original jerky chew. Shredded beef jerky. I thought I said something else for a second. I don't know. But this here, I'm not impersonating. I just have it on here, but whenever I go somewhere, I take it off. I also have uh, my dad's old security bag that I would put on it instead. Um, but just here at home, I have it on there just, just for looks. You know, here at home. Looks only. That's it. It's an, now the bat the badge it's on my vest. It's an old police badge. I mean, it's not like vintage or anything like that. But the town was was it was run. It's run down. It there's well, it's actually it's called Brady Lake up in Ohio. So I'm way out of jurisdiction. I'm clear down in West Virginia. But uh, as you can see, it said Brady Lake. But Brady Lake, there is a lake, and it was also uh, the name of a town, but the town was divided up amongst the surrounding areas, the surrounding towns, or s however you want, whatever you want to call them. And it, it was just run down, and everything like that. But the lake's still there, like I said. Everything's, you know, it's for one, it's out of jurisdiction, and two, the town, it's just. It, it's no more, so there is no. I don't. I'm pretty sure there's no more Brady Lake Police Department. So I got it at a yard sale. It's an out of service badge. It doesn't even have a badge number on it. I mean, for Pete's sake, my dad's old security badge has a badge number on it. You know. So that's just only for looks, but I'm gonna get a uh, a uh, uh, different badge later on. Probably like some sort of like security badge or something like that in the future when I get my new handcuffs and then I will do videos on those and put the badge on there and stuff like that like I said in previous videos I think uh, I don't know if I mentioned it or not if so great if not then I then you're gonna figure it out but um I'm going to have uh going to get um yeah, a uh, Hawaii Five O badge just because it's just a replica. Why not? Um, I'm not gonna have it on my vest very often. I won't have it on there very often at all. And you know, if I'm just down, what I what we call in the hauler, down in the hills with my cousins, I have a badge holder here for my belt. You know, so I got that here for my friend Caleb. But um, yeah. Uh, if I'm not wearing my vest, I'll just throw it on here, you know, grab the BB gun, or I've got... You can see here. Uh, there we go. 
the BB caliber. It's 4.5 millimeter, uh, .177 caliber. Just a little BB gun. Got that as well as this little thing here. It's just a toy gun. Doesn't even make noise anymore. The slide. It used to click back, but it uh, it broke, so I put some tape on it. I just take it down to the holler and play with my cousins, you know, whatever. Boom, boom. It's, it's all there really is to it. Um, yeah. I have those two that I have. I'm a sunglasses fell. My old uh, Airsoft. Didn't say BB on it, but it. I don't know if you can see it enough, but it is a six millimeter. You can't see it, but it's a six millimeter. Um, one second. Yeah, at the very end of this little warning label. Like right at the tip of my finger, it says BB. Those last two marks it says BB. It says Cal. Uh, it was all messed up. There's a big mess about that, but yeah. So check something real fast. Yeah. Go ahead and end it off here, everybody. And I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget the YouTuber of the day is Steve the Gamer fifty five. And I'll see y'all in the next one.